Day ends up taking the loss there, but other than the leadoff walk, do you feel like there were things happening that inning that were kind of like out of his hands a little bit? Well, you know, Darren's pretty tough critic of himself, but he uh, he's performed at such a high level, as good as any relief pitcher you want to see. But you know, I was kind of happy they finally hit the one line drive to left field in a way. But that's the way it goes sometimes, and we've had some of the benefit of that also. So you know, he uh, just kind of. Some of the, you know, last night there were obviously a lot of hard hit balls, but sometimes you go through periods where those things happen for you and happen against you. You got to overcome them. But uh, you know we were close. Look, is a game like this one tougher to digest than? Pardon? Is, is a game like this one where you know you guys come back, get the lead, then lose it, tougher to digest than maybe a game like like last night? Or? No, not necessarily. At this point, you know, you know it's about wins and losses, and you know whether there's fly ball barely out of your. Jam shot out of your grass were a couple of them, and swinging bunts. You know, it's it's all relevant. You know, we didn't do much offensively other than six in, and we put a little something together there. We were hoping to try to make it stand up. You know, they're pitching well, and we're not doing a whole lot with what they're doing. So, you know, we uh, man, we missed a cutoff man that didn't allow us to set up a double play where we had to play at a different depth than we'd like to have played there. So, but. Uh, you know, it's close play. It could have been a close play at third, too, and then you're looking at it the other way. There's a lot of things that go on there. But Darren, uh, you know, he's had some counts there real close. You know, he pitches in to, to set up other things, and, you know, a good hitter's going to get out over the plate on him like Hunter, and those things happen, too. You talked about the throws to the... Pardon? Missing the cutoff man with, with Parra, but also with the scope, when, when scope's going for that ball, is there anything else he can... I mean... Is there anything he didn't do that he could have done to catch that ball that dropped in between? No, him? I don't think so. That'd be John's one of the best second basemen you'll see. That just uh, they hit it in a place we couldn't get a glove on it. Was it fair? I didn't know how close was it fair or foul. A couple of feet, I don't know. Just one of those things. Hit them where they ain't. You know, nothing you can do. Then I think uh, other tough one was the ball that uh, Suzuki had another one that went about 70 feet that was a key part of that inning. The way in was really good again tonight. You know, usually kind of curious to see how he was going to be after his last outing, a little, little extra and also working on four days. But he was really good tonight against a tough right-hand lineup. Look, when you have a game like this, when you get uh, a great performance from Chan, a three-run run from Parra, you're in position to win it don't. Uh, do, do you just take it and then just go go to tomorrow? As, or yeah, I know. As opposed to what you know, you don't have any alternatives. It's kind of it's where you are, and it's the world we live in. It's tough, but we've had some really good wins that uh, maybe um, didn't look that way for a long time. So it all, you know, the baseball gods aren't always kind to you, and uh, you just gotta, you know, you wear it and uh, you try to come back and and know that. Tomorrow, you got a chance to have a different feeling. So, you know, they're they're fighting for the same thing we are, and we're going to get everybody's, you know, best shot. We're not sneaking up on anybody, and that's a good thing because, you know, because uh, you know the things that our guys have done in the past. A few weeks ago, when uh, pardon a few week, a few weeks ago in Tampa, when Ote had his other loss, and he'd said, "Oh well, he gets many mulligans for." Uh, for all he's done for you guys. Does it feel the same way tonight? Of course. I, I feel that way with all our guys that go about it the right way and prepare and, and are locked in and competing. You know, there's other good people in this game that, uh, you know, bring good things. And it's, it's, the game's not always kind to you, but it doesn't keep you from, you know, nobody cares more than Darren, but he's not the only one. You know, it's uh, Brad had a really good seventh inning that will go completely, you know. And uh, but that's why it's a team game, that it's, it's a product, it's a sum of the parts. And um, you can't make the ball be hit to your best defender. Your best hitter can't hit every time there's a situation. It's a team game. You get your turn, and the ball, you know, everybody's got to do the thing to get to the end game. And more times than not, uh, you know, I like our chances there. So, you know, we'll uh, um, do it again tomorrow. Okay, thank you.